No, I refuse. I will not watch another gold making video from Kendwick. Not again. I, I mean, are, are you sure? You've got to be kidding me. All they do is show people how to make gold over and over again. What's the point? Well, I can make about 100,000 gold now. Paint me yellow and give me a cello. Where do I sign up? Well, everybody knows that at least once a year, I've got to release something to do with stealing, making gold, etc. And today, I'm giving you the build to do just that. Stealing in itself is a waste of time, but stealing when you're maxed out is a whole other story. Are you kidding me? I just wrote this story. Carly, shut the heck up. Nobody reads anymore. And now, let's talk about those skills. Obviously, upgrade your Thieves Guild skill line so that you're easily forgotten, sell items for more gold, and have a free get out of jail card. You'll also have easier escapes and finally decrease detection. Now also, if you're a mindless savage only out to murder and kill, upgrade your Dark Brotherhood line for perks to killing people and stealing their goods, such as less witness detection and easy runaway expedition. Finally, upgrade your dang ledger domain! Not upgrading your ledger domain as a thief is as dumb as riding a camel as an orc. This... This just feels wrong. Without Ledger Domain, all of your thief buddies will laugh at the fact that your hiding sucks, you can't pickpocket, and you can barely sell anything to the fence. Dude, it's just one bread. Just buy it! No! You're not gonna be able to force locks, and when you're feeling a little bit in the red and blue, you ain't gonna pay as much. That's it! You're going to pay big time for the crimes you've committed! Hey, do you mind dropping my fees by about uh, roughly 40%? Eh, sure, why not? So now that you've got your steely skills, let's get some armor. Uh, gee whiz, Kevdwood, I don't want another one of your dumb- Whenever I steal stuff, I've got one build to get the job done. Remember, all medium armor. That gives you stamina recovery, needed for crouch, improved sneak, and that good old sanic speed. For the sets, you're gonna be running two sets in particular, good old night silence and jailbreaker. Combined, these sets will give you minor expedition at all times, increasing that beautiful movement speed, as well as completely ignoring that movement speed penalty. Try to get prosperous on everything, because you're not aiming for damage here, you're wanting that recovery, so focus on that previous most underused trait, which now gives you regen instead. Wait a minute, do you hear that? It's the bell calling all of those people to come argue about CP with me! Today, go over to the Lover Tree and jam a ton of points into Mooncalf and whatever the heck else to acquire the passive Wind Running, which just improves your movement speed by 2%. Also, are you ready to practice those squats? Throw a ton of points into Shade to get that nice crouch recovery. Finally, unleash your inner nerd and glyph all of the armor with stamina and your jewelry with stamina recovery, allowing you to literally run away from all of your problems with ease. Johnny, you done your math yet? Nice try, Johnny. Get over here. For your Munda Stone, focus on the steed, obviously, as it literally turns your character into a horse. Er, wait, no, hold on, just a second. No, it makes him run faster. I apologize, everyone. I didn't mean to joke horsely. And for that final speed boost of major expedition, I'd say have retreating maneuver always equipped for when you're not stealing. But when you are stealing, have potions of invisibility and speed, which is created using Blessed Thistle, Namira's Rot, and Nunhut. Remember, this potion will take away 10,000 health, but don't worry, you'll be fast and invisible. Okay, I'm just gonna take my potion here and- ah, 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 ah. Oh, look at that, I'm fast and invisible. Or, you know, you can always just use that Dark Brotherhood passive. <laughs> Thanks for the speed boost, nerd! And there you have it! Fun times, am I right? Just make sure that you actually know how to steal, unlike No Steal Sammy over here. Alright, and steal! <laughs> Anyways, I hope I've satisfied your thirst for thievery, and now, go forth and steal from thy peasants! But remember, that there is one way to steal every single item in the game, and make one million gold in ten minutes, and that is... <laughs>